Number 55, the table above shows the values of Ka for four weak acids, which are the following pairs of chemical species when combined in equimolar amounts, equimolar amounts will result in a buffer with a pH closest to 7.5. Now, we are talking about buffer and we're talking about something that would be close to pH of 7.5, and we're given all these Ka values. The equation you should be thinking in, uh, on top of your head is gotta be the Henderson-Hasselbalch equation. pH is equal to pKa plus log concentration of your uh, conjugate base over the original acid, right? And we have equimolar, aka, your acid and the conjugate base is the same amount. So if you're just to randomly put like, I don't know, like a 10 and a 10, the point is they're the same number, so they will close, uh, cancel to one. So pH is equal to pKa plus log of one. What's log of one? It's a zero, so that just goes away. pH is basically equal to pKa. Well, you're given the Ka value, so how do you calculate the pKa? Well, pKa, just like the pH calculations, is negative log of Ka, and this is also in the front of the packet on your formula sheet, so you really don't need to memorize this anyway. So long story short, negative log of uh, whatever value should get me something close to the pH of 7.5, so that's what it is. And if you guys look at it, well, I hope you know how to do the math, and basically it's gonna be this, ACLO, which is why answer choice C would be correct, ACLO, and it's conjugate base, CLO minus.